Excel's left and right formula will allow you to extract specific information from the beginning and end of a text string respectively. In this video, we'll walk through an exercise of extracting an employee's category and level from their employee identifier. Let's talk about how we use the left and right formula. In our example, we have a employee roster with an employee number, a unique employee identifier, and then other relevant information for each employee. What we wanna do is understand the category and the level that each employee corresponds to. For instance, in this first employee's row, they have an employee identifier that starts with A, corresponding with management, and an employee number that corresponds with X, which corresponds with level one. So what we would wanna do is put in A and X for their category and their level. Given this is Excel and we want to minimize manual data entry as much as possible, let's figure out a clever way to accomplish this task without going through one by one. What we can use are the left and right formula. So if I use left, select my text and put one. Now what Excel has done is it's trimmed my string to just show me the first character on the left. If I change this to two, now it's included the period as it's showing the first two characters to the left of my string. If I change this to three, now I get the first number in my employee identifier. If I change this to 255, I would get the full string as Excel will show me all 255 characters to the left of my string. I'll change this back to one. And then if we want to do the same thing for our employee level, we can use write text one, and this will show us the furthest right character in our string or the character at the end of our string. If I change this again to three, now we have is the last number, the period, and the employee level lookup. So important thing to remember, left will reference the beginning of your string, right will reference the end of your string. If you want to use this with a VLOOKUP, you could simply write VLOOKUP. Your lookup value will be the left formula on your employee identifier. Your table array will be the employee category locked in place. Your column index number will be two, and then you want an exact match. Now for each employee, you have the employee category that they respond to using a combination of a left formula and a VLOOKUP. We can do the same thing with our employee number. If I write VLOOKUP, my lookup value will be the right of C3. My table array will be my employee value table, column index number two, exact match. And now I have the level for each one of my employees. Using the left and right formula makes it very, very easy easy to trim strings and use only the portion you need. If I select the cell and use evaluate formula, alt MV, I can see exactly what is going on in my formula. And I can see that I'm looking at left of this string for one character will respond A. And then I'm performing a VLOOKUP, which returns management. Helpful for understanding how your formula works.